Hello, thank you so much for coming back to watch today's beverage taste test. So for you today, I have the Stevens, look at me pronouncing it right. Yeah. I have the Stevens Candy Cane Hot Chocolate. So if you'd like to see our thoughts about this and if it's worth picking up, because it's probably on sale since it's after Christmas, let's be honest. So um, yeah, keep on watching. Uh, make sure that you do subscribe, hit that notification bell, that way you are notified when we upload, which is seven days a week. So, okay. So, I feel like it's still the Christmas season all the way through, like, New Year's. For sure. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so this was actually gifted to me last year for a Christmas gift. Um, and it's like the jumbo four-pound family size. But they do sell this in the regular one-pound can. Um, but this has real peppermint candy cane pieces in it. You're not a big fan of peppermint, are you? Not my favorite thing. Okay, but luckily, um, I don't care. I'm aware of this. <laughs> anyway. Pumpkin spice. Pumpkin spice, yeah. Anyway, so we're going to go ahead and try it and see what we think of it. Okay. It looks like a good hot chocolate. I mean, it's like dark brown. It smells like peppermint. Mmm. It's very peppermint forward. You don't taste the peppermint? I do, but I don't think it's mostly peppermint. I think it's like mostly chocolate, and then you get a little peppermint at the end. I taste the peppermint. I like that. That tastes really good. It's better than most peppermint things. Look at that. Better than most peppermint things. I like that. Do you think it's better than the hazelnut hot chocolate? Yeah, but that doesn't take much. Okay. <laughs> okay. It does not take much. I like this a lot. It's um, it's rich, it's creamy. Yes, it, you can definitely tell it's hot chocolate, but it does have a good amount of peppermint. It's not, I mean, it's like a good blend, I guess. Nothing out overpowers the yeah. other thing. So, okay. So, um, I'm not going to have to repurchase this for like ever because it's a four pound can, but what do you think of it? Uh, you want me to give a number? Well, I mean, which, okay. okay, so if we had, this was the only hot chocolate we had, would you drink it? Yes. Yes. If we had like regular Swiss Miss, would you prefer the Swiss Miss over this? Uh, probably. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I really like this. I think it's really, really good. I think the artwork is adorable on it. What's wrong with that bear? He looks like he's going to the bathroom. Time. Stop it. You ruin every video. Um, I think this is really, really good. So on a scale of one to five, what do you think of the Stevens um, candy cane cocoa? I'll give it a three and a half. Three and a half. Wow. That's pretty, that's pretty high. I would probably give this a five. I love this. I think this is amazing. It's so good. Um, this is probably my most favorite Stevens thing I've tried. I know you, do you still prefer the apple cider over this? Yes. Okay. I think this is better than the apple cider personally, but there we go. But anyway, um, so yeah, that's a pretty good score. I mean, even three and a half from him on a peppermint item, and you're not hugely into peppermint, so. I am not. But anyway, um, I hope everyone had a wonderful holiday yesterday if you did celebrate, but thank you so much for coming by and watching this week's beverage taste test. Um, if I can find it on Amazon, I'll link it down below for you. It will be an Amazon affiliate link. You're welcome to use it, but you don't have to. But anyway, um, have a great one. Um, if you did enjoy this video, make sure you do um, thumbs it up and share it. We'd really, really appreciate it. Leave a comment down below. Um, do you like peppermint things? I mean, I know we're kind of coming to the close of that season, but I would love to know if you like peppermint, because I know some people absolutely hate it. You hate wintergreen. I loathe. Yes, yes, I, yeah, and so did your grandma. Yes. Okay. You don't like peppermint either. Okay. You don't like mint. So there's some people that it's like amazing, and some people absolutely hate it, so. But anyway, um, don't forget, you're welcome to follow me on my other social media, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's all at Budget Glam, babe. Don't go anywhere quite yet. Another video should start auto-playing here very shortly. We can always click on one of the ones that'll be popping up around the screen. So yeah, we'll see you here in just a sec.